Hey there guys, today I'm going to show you how to use the Sprout Social listening tool. This is one of Sprout Social's most powerful tools, and in simple terms, it's a tool that allows you to track what people say about your brand, your industry, or even your competitors across social media. So step number one on how to use the Sprout Social listening tool is to log into Sprout Social. You can use the affiliate link in the description for a free trial. And what we first want to do is go on over to the left hand tab over here. These are kind of like the navigation tab in Sprout Social. Click on the listening tab. It's a fifth or sixth one down here. And then what we want to do here is scroll down to the bottom here where it says create topic. Then what we want to do here is next we want to start with a template and choose. Do we want to go with brand health, which is kind of like brand awareness, industry insights, competitive analysis, campaign analysis, or event monitoring? There's a lot of different features here. And if you guys aren't seeing the importance of this tool, we can understand what people around the web are saying about us. So this is going to use a spider to crawl social media platforms and see what people are saying we can create custom alerts and notifications for this if you're not seeing the light with this you need to all right so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go with brand health just because brand awareness is always huge right say if someone was posting in a forum talking about your brand you want to be on top of it so first what we do here is it says customize your topics appearance so you need to name the brand name here let's go with min media that's the name of my company then choose a description brand awareness I'm gonna call it then what you can do here is you can check what sources you want it to be found on I'm gonna do X Facebook Facebook, you can do Instagram, you can do YouTube, LinkedIn, Reddit, Tumblr, and then just the general web, which is crazy. Then next what we want to do is we need to craft your query. This is the exact phrasing on what you want people to search for when they phrase it, right? Enter the word or phrase. I'm going to go with min media because that's what I want people to be talking about, right? Then you can add queries and keywords. I just tend to keep it really simple though, if I'm being honest. And then you can exclude certain keywords. Like say if there's a word that's like really similar to your brand, like maybe there's another min media plumbing somewhere else in a different state. I would exclude min media plumbing, which is a weird name let's be honest then you can exclude all the noises this is all options you know like sweepstakes coupons nothing's more annoying than coupon sites then alert configuration you can have it select who should we notify because a lot of times multiple people are using sprout social and you can just add different users within sprout social then you can define the alert sensitivity optional filters there's a lot of stuff that you can customize here which is really really good then when we're done here we can click on preview topic if you make any edits just click on update topic preview as you can see here I'm already seeing notifications on X also known formerly known as Twitter there you have it guys this is Sprout Social's listening tool if you haven't used it yet you have to because here's what's happening guys people will be talking negatively around the web about you you need to fix that and also you just need to be on top of what people are saying you can create custom trends maybe your competitors are blowing up with a certain trend again consider signing up with Sprout Social using my link in the description I'll see you in the next one guys hit me up in the comments bye bye